On my way back to CapCut, let me show you how you can do basic adjustments to the color grading. We use this clip and then I go to adjustments and by the way I use the default layout. Use this adjustment option on the customized click on plus sign and you have to resize it to have it as big as your footage. Then make sure it's selected. If it isn't highlighted in the timeline, left click on it. And then we have these adjustment options. Basic, HSL, Hue Saturation Lightness, Curves and the Color Wheel. In principle they all do the same. It depends on what you want to work with. Let us for example go over Basic and here we have under adjustment the temperature, the hue and the saturation. If I for example want to make this a little bit colder, I use these settings. You can see we've totally changed the style, the feel of this footage. Let me make it a little bit warmer. I would for example use something like this. It's a little bit oversaturated but you get the idea. If you want to undo it, you have to click on redo but be careful not the top one, this for the LUTs. You have to use this one for adjustments. Just click on it and you've got your default settings back. Below you can go into detail with brightness, contrast, highlight, shadows. If you are used to photo editing, it's kind of like Lightroom. Here we have a color wheel. As I've said, it does the same. Let's for example change the tint and we'll make it a little bit colder. Left click on the center dot, drag it around. You can also left click drag on the sides. This is for brightness and for saturation, but only for the specific category, in this case the tint. If for example want to change the shadows, let me go up and down with the saturation and the brightness, and this is only affecting the shadows. The general strength slider is for the intensity of it all, and we have a redo, which is basically a default button as well. If you're used to using curves, you can use that here as well. So yet again, there's the histogram that you might have seen in Lightroom when it comes to photo editing. HSL is for hue, saturation, lightness, and here can target specific colors. So here, let me make the water a little bit more intense. And I also want to make the greenish parts pop a little bit in the background. For beginners, I would say use the basic option and maybe check out HSL to target specific colors. But if you're more advanced, try out the curves and the color wheel. And this is how you can do the basic adjustments to the color grading in CapCut. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.